Hey there, I have a good thought for you today, a good God thought. Before I go swimming, when I'm in Puerto Rico, I pick out a handful of sand, and every grain of sand, according to Psalm 139, represents a good thought that God has for you. And the thought that I believe God wants you to hear today is this, the sky is the limit for those who put their eyes on me. You know, sometimes we limit ourselves. We look at ourselves, we look at circumstances, we just look at difficulties. But God says, get your eyes beyond that and look to me. And he says, the sky is the limit for you when you put your eyes on me. I love it in 1 Corinthians chapter 2, uh, Paul tells us that the eye has not seen nor the ear heard the good things that God has prepared for those who love him. Not just in the sweet by and by, but now, here in the here and now. Don't we all enjoy hearing the words of Jeremiah 29? I, I know the thoughts that I have for you, says the Lord. Thoughts and good and not of evil to give you in the future and a hope. And I just want to say to you, my dear friend, wherever you are in the world, the sky is the limit for you when you put your eyes on God. You know, the expanse of the sky is just limitless. And so God can do great things in you. Sadly, in Psalm 78, the people of God, Israel, they limited God. They did not remember God. They did not remember his power. But let's lift our eyes towards the God who created everything. And I just speak this word of the Lord to you, straight from God's heart to yours. And it's this, the sky is a limit for you when you put your eyes on the Lord. May the Lord bless you.